Welcome to Flash from Scratch, tutorial number two. File types. Um, we'll start with if you have your CS5 program opened and go to File, Import, and you can import to what's called the library. And Flash can import just about any type of file. It can Im you can import videos, AVIs, you can import GIFs, bitmaps, JPEGs, MP3s. Pretty much any format can be imported to. I'll just click that, and it puts it in this thing called the library right here. There's that 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 sound sound. Besides importing files, naturally you can export files and if we look here you can export files you could export JPEGs you could export GIFs uh, but the most important files are what's called the FLA that's the one that you're working with when you're working with CS5 that's the one you're building your program with the next one is when you make that and run it it generates what's called a SWIFT SWF file and that SWF file is the actual compressed for lack of better words uh, file that you're actually going to be putting on a website or that's the file that people would look at when they want to run whatever you made using this FLA file and if you wanted to put a SWIFT file up on on a website for example flash would generate this HTML and if, if you're familiar with websites you're certainly familiar with HTML and this HTML file that's produced when you publish your FLA your flash file it directs the person that when you click on it it'll directly open this Swift file so for example if I click on this my browser will be told to find that Swift file and whatever was in that Swift file would be shown and all I have is that little picture that that B and that B if I open the, FL, the FLA there he is there and later on we'll show you how to to do that so remember any kind of files can just about come in and any kind of files can just about go out but the important ones are the HTML, the Swift file, and the FLA. Hope you learned something from this short tutorial. Hope you use what you learned.